This is the truss elevation in the XZ plane that we have modeled, which is having pin supports at the bottom and the points at which truss is connected to the columns are having the moment releases. We are analyzing this structure for gravity loads, but lateral load may hit the structure or even self-weight induces some eccentricities which may lead to the structural collapse. This is what we call as the collapse mechanism. Let me tell you the reason behind this. Let's have a freestanding pin based column. If any lateral load is applied to the free end of this column, then resistive moment can't be induced at the base. So in result, the column will collapse. This is known as unstable column. But on the other hand, let's have a freestanding fixed base column. And if the lateral load is applied to its free end, resistive moment induced at the base and the column will deflect like this. This is known as the stable column.